I'm so tired. Hey guys, it's Kelly and today I'm going to be vlogging. So I'm sorry about the background. It's literally 7.23 in the morning. I woke up at 5.50 to drive Brendan to work today. It is Saturday. Is it the 19th? Yeah, it's the 19th of October and yeah, so Brendan has work today and I am going to start vlogging because I just want to. Well, so this is my new series. I'm trying to get back into working out and like healthy lifestyle and stuff like that. So I wanted to like start vlogging it so that way it's like maybe I can at least motivate at least one of you to start a healthy lifestyle. And that's just not just working out and like eating healthy. It's also like stay, trying to stay off my phone more and then reading more. So actually this morning, um, I was gonna run you down on like what I'm doing today, but um, I'm gonna be doing a ton of homework. I'll just add that in, but also a ton of other stuff. But I'm gonna start my morning by reading a few chapters in Girl Stop Apologizing by Rachel Hollis. I just finished Girl Watch Your wash your face this past week so i wanted to start reading that i'm also gonna read i'm also gonna read my cup it says messy bun and getting stuff done now i'm gonna drink this it's 25 ounces um if you're watching this right now go grab water and drink it i am back from the dead feels like so it is now 11 33 i have still not had breakfast i have not done my homework. What I said I was gonna do earlier was like do read a little bit and then do my homework. I read a little bit and then passed out. So yeah, but um, yeah, I'm gonna start making breakfast right now. But the reason why I passed out wasn't because I'm necessarily tired. It's because I have the worst cramps. I have the most painful cramps and nothing helps them and like, I have gone to doctors on oh, doctors and mentioned it. I've really only gone to two doctors or three doctors now. But nobody really says anything. They all say like take more ibuprofen and the amount of ibuprofen I take, it should be like not over the counter. <laughs> like I should have to be able to get a prescription for it because I don't think it's legal. And I don't know what to do at this point because I am in so much pain all the time. But I'm hoping that maybe doing like a healthy it's not like I have, let me change, so I want to do this like get my ass back together type of video series, but like I just want to preface this, I have not been unhealthy, like I used to be really unhealthy when I was like really really fat, but um, since then I haven't been like super unhealthy, like I have celiac disease and like a ton of other allergies, so it's kind of like hard to be unhealthy unhealthy, just because there's not that many gluten free options there are a ton don't get me wrong but like you know what I mean but um yeah so I'm hoping that that will help this like if I eat more like greens and stuff even though I like, hate greens but it's fine but yeah so right now I'm gonna just do breakfast and I finished my first one of these right when I woke up because I was so thirsty I am so out of breath just let me say that first so first off I finished making my breakfast and I was way too into my music so I was like dancing around and you know but um then by the time that I was like okay let me eat my food Amazon got here so I had to run downstairs to grab it but they're also cleaning the uh like outside of our apartment building and like the floor space where you walk and stuff to get to your apartment okay whatever and um it's literally soaking wet <laughs> so yeah and i was also trying to like dodge the guy with like the hose thing so that way it wasn't in his way i just got more in his way so it's fine. i guess before i show you what um i made for breakfast which i already told you but i'm gonna open my amazon because i am very impatient i would definitely do this after breakfast normally i wouldn't i wouldn't i don't want to impress Okay, the first thing I got, drum roll please, is this little 
GPS slash dash cam mount holder. I got this obviously for my camera, but I'm gonna use it when like Brendan's driving, so that way we can vlog in the car while driving. And then the last thing I got are these rubber rings, so that way I can wear them when working out because my wedding engagement ring are like really making calluses and it really hurt. I might honestly wear these a lot. Brendan wears rubber rings a lot. But yeah, I have really fat fingers, so <laughs> yeah, but um, this whole pack was like eight bucks. Well, that feels really good because my fingers have been so swollen because I'm like super bloated, so I might actually just wear these today. But yeah. So this is my breakfast. I finished another one of these waters. I have um, the potatoes and chicken sausage. I've never had it. I don't know if I'm going to like it, so I'll keep you up on that turkey bacon and half a bagel with cream cheese. So yeah, I'm going to go eat this. And yeah, I really like this because my, it matches my ring or my nails. So yeah, I'm gonna send a picture to Brendan. But yeah, so let's go eat because I am hungry and it's 12.30 now, so. All right, we have officially made it to the part of the day that I don't wanna do, homework. I have so much work to do, let's do it tonight, and I just have to get it done. Like, that's just what I gotta do. And I gotta sit down and do it for a little bit, and yeah. But I'm really hoping that it doesn't take that long because I don't want this video to be like a flop. Like, I don't want it to be like, okay guys, this is what I eat. But it might honestly just turn into what I eat in the day because I can take the time, the two minutes, to show you exactly what I'm eating about this day. But yeah, I also, I'm sorry it's so loud outside, but um, I'm also thinking about doing a like morning routine for a online college student because I do school online. I actually start four more courses on Monday. <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> That's a good spot. <laughs> okay, but yeah, I have to do my homework and I will update you either when I'm done, or whenever I'm next hungry. But also, um, I didn't, I wasn't a huge fan of the chicken sausage, honestly. Um, I don't really know the difference between that nutrition and like normal sausage nutrition. But I don't know. It wasn't like something that like I'm like, ooh, I love that. Like I ate like half of it. So yeah, but. Everything else is good. I love turkey bacon. I recently started eating it and like I thought I hated it before and I love turkey bacon. Back to my food because I'm trying to be actually healthy but not like focus too much on calories and stuff. But I had uh, 455 calories for breakfast and I have like my daily intake is 1800 and um... It is that high because I used the LifeSum app to get like my calories and stuff for like what I wanted to do because Fitbit was literally giving me like 1100 calories a day and I was dying. Like I don't think I even eat 1800 calories a day. Like I probably will never even get to that but it gives me a lot of wiggle room. My turkey bacon was 120 calories for all of it and there's two grams of protein per serving so eight grams of protein which i guess isn't that good actually and then the turkey bacon is 13 grams for one okay that's actually pretty good i guess and then so i'll just tell you this it i had 41 percent carbs 46 grams 38 percent fat 19 grams and 21 percent protein 24 grams I guess that's pretty good for like one meal. I honestly don't really know that much, but it's fine. And I also have had 72 ounces of water so far. I'm going on a tangent, but I'm not counting calories because I want to be on like a diet. I'm counting my calories for right now because I want to know how much I'm eating right now. Like how much I'm consuming and how much I'm probably overeating. But yeah, I'm probably going to do it for like the next month, I think, just because I feel like it might help me, if that makes sense. But yeah, I'm going to do my homework before I 
continue what I'm doing and procrastinating, but I'm also watching Shameless, so. So I'm finally done my homework. I'm literally laying on the couch. It's kind of a terrible angle, but you're welcome. But um, yeah, so I'm done my homework. Yeah, so I'm finally done my homework. I'm now just laying on the couch with Cooper and I have a shameless going. I was gonna watch it while I was doing my homework, but I couldn't because I had to watch a video, so whatever. But it's 2.30, I think I already said that, but whatever. And uh, I'm just gonna be doing some YouTube oriented things. I have to, I don't have to do anything, but I have to edit a video. And then I also have to make a new banner just because, I don't know, I haven't used, like I don't really like my banner that I made. It's good for what I did because I'm not like an interior designer, graphic designer. But I don't know, it's just kind of boring. So I kind of want to spice it up. It's probably gonna be very boring regardless, but I guess I'll show you when I'm done. But I have to edit a video and get it uploaded. I'm probably just gonna upload it today, why not? and yeah i don't think i'm gonna do set days of the week i think i'm just going to have videos going throughout the week if that makes any sense and let me know if you guys like that idea i am going to start vlogging a ton more just because this is my life i literally just i don't sit on the couch and lay down all the time but i'm like i do my homework right here so i'm technically on the couch all the time but um yeah i just want to also use me doing videos and like vlogging as a way of holding myself accountable. So I kind of want to do it more often than not just because it will keep me more accountable if that makes sense. Because even today I'm like, oh, maybe I'll go to the gym later. But like, I didn't want to go to the gym today because of my cramps. I wanted to go to the gym tomorrow specifically because Brenda will be home and we can go to the gym together. And that also inclines me more to go to the gym if I have somebody to go with. But whatever so yeah today i'm just gonna finish my youtube things um i have to submit a quiz that i finished but i'm just waiting for a little bit i'm gonna get right on to that and drink your water but yeah i'm gonna watch shameless edit a video and make a thumbnail not well i've made a thumbnail too but make a thumbnail and a banner I think that's all I'm gonna be doing right now for YouTube. I might plan out a few videos, but they're mostly just gonna be vlogs. I'm sorry if you can hear the dogs barking or literally anything outside of my apartment building. I'm trying to like not use the air, so that's why. All the windows are open, because it feels nice outside, but it doesn't sound nice outside because of how loud everybody is, but whatever. I'll see you guys on the flippity flip. <laughs> Please be an office fan, please be an office fan. Okay, I, I don't have everything done yet. I just finished my channel banner. I guess I'll show you it. Just because, oh, there's Cooper. Oh, I have a funny story about Cooper in a second, but let me show you my banner before I forget. Kelly Hastings, new videos every week. I don't know, it's boring, but before it said Monday, Wednesday, Friday. I know it's really boring, but last, I am not a, designer by any means so i tried my best and that's all we can ask for you're right you're right we were just i just took him out to go pee because um we do like this like time thing where it's like three times a day he goes pee so that way it's like it's not changing on the weekends and um i'm so sorry outside is so loud i really hope you can't hear it but whatever um so i took him outside and there's this little kid in our apartment building who like either doesn't speak english but i know he his family does but i think he has like a lisp or something he runs up to cooper and stabs him in the face with his hand and i'm like and i just see his parents let him do this and i'm like and then he runs away because cooper obviously didn't react well he like was like he didn't bite him or anything he just like was like dude the heck and this kid runs away screaming this dog has rabies and i'm like no <laughs> doesn't have rabies but all right yeah we just got back from outside and that was what happened oh i also got something in the mail so let me show you i was supposed to show you that first but i sat on the couch before i remembered but i got this book from free prints photo books and i think it was like eight bucks 
but it's so small. <laughs> it's just our engagement photos, but whatever, I'll show you it. This is the book I got. I think I spent like 11 bucks on it, or I think it was like 10 bucks, and that was including shipping. So it says engaged December 13th, or no, December 31st, 2018. And then like there's photos, and I think it's cute. Like it's not like a bad little book, but it's so tiny. But yeah. And then the back's just marbled. And it says free prints photo books. I'm gonna go edit my video and then I'll update you. I'm actually starving right now. I don't know why. I don't know what happened. Like I got super hungry as soon as I walked downstairs. But I guess I ate like four hours ago. So yeah, um, I might make nachos. Yeah, it's not gonna be good because that just not good for you. This is definitely, without a doubt, the worst place I've ever put my phone or my camera. I literally have it on top of my water bottle. I don't think anybody has ever been as dumb as me, but whatever. So I just finished editing. I have to edit my thumbnail, but um, I'm gonna do that while it's exporting, but my computer is moving so slow. I purposely waited to like export it until I emailed myself my thumbnail pictures so that way I can edit them, but my computer is literally moving so slow and I don't understand why. I am about to scream, but whatever. So, um, I'm actually like almost done everything that I have had planned for today. I have a little bit of extra stuff that I could do for tomorrow, but I don't know. I'm really happy with the part of my life that I'm at right now and it's only 4.30 or for 40 or whatever but um i don't know it's pretty pretty good if i don't say so myself but if i do say so myself is what i'm trying to say but um yeah so i'm just emailing myself that's the water if you can hear it i'm sorry i closed the door because um like our sliding doors because it's so loud outside and people are literally putting music so loud that i couldn't even think without blowing up but also i have had my like rubber rings on for the past like few hours i love yeah, i'm gonna edit my thumbnails i just sent them to my phone but yeah i'm also definitely making nachos because i really want nachos since telling myself that like, i need them so i'm gonna edit my thumbnails and export my video and upload it i feel like it honestly might be a little late to upload a video but whatever i'm gonna do it and I'm sorry I'm going back in my video so but yeah so I'm just gonna upload it tonight I don't really care at this point like who's gonna care if it's uploaded today or like tomorrow morning not me you know what time it is nachos so before you guys are like wasn't this supposed to be like a healthy video you're right but the thing is Everything in moderation. So, yeah, I'm gonna make nachos. So, I'm gonna be honest, right here, right now, you already know this, but I don't know how to cook, so I made chicken nuggets <laughs> for my meat, so you're welcome. But I'm gonna take, I'm gonna eat a lot of chips, so I'm gonna probably use a little bit more because they're probably all broken. But, um, we usually get the salt-free Trader Joe's chips, but we've been getting the yellow ones from the yellow organic ones from Aldi. But yeah, so I have it, my oven set at 350 and I'm gonna put it in for about seven to eight minutes. And then at the end, I'm gonna show you the finished product. So I'm adding this little segment in here because I just put my nachos in the oven and I wanted to talk to you guys for a quick second about um, moderation. So, I am the type of person who, if they cheat once, they feel like they have to cheat for the rest of the day, and that's just simply not the case. You can eat something unhealthy every day and still lose weight. You don't have to be on a strict, strict diet. Like, um, I've lost 50 pounds in the past, and during no part of that time was I, like, restricting myself whatsoever um all i did 
was I ate until I was full. Like not like ate until I was like dying of like being too full. Put in perspective that just to eat until you're full, but don't restrict food. I feel like that's where I've messed up in the past and I want you guys to learn from my mistake and to eat what you need or like want pretty much. Like I don't need nachos right now, but my soul needs nachos. So I made nachos. It's 1000% healthier to make your unhealthy foods at home. Like I don't know exactly how much, how many calories this will be, but I'm just gonna average it out to like 850 just because I feel like there's no way it's more than that and yeah so it's like I don't know I will eventually actually size out nachos but today not today but um yeah so I made it at home and it's definitely a lot healthier to do so so if you love nachos or if you love like anything else like a hamburger like you can definitely make that for less calories at home and still enjoy it the same amount so I've definitely tell you to do that and you're one saving a ton of money anything into your diet but think of it more of a lifestyle change is what I'm trying to say and I know this is a very lengthy video and there's a ton of stuff that doesn't really have to do with the core meaning of this video but all I hope you take from this is to not put yourself into a little mold of a diet think of it more of a lifestyle change and you will be 10,000 times happier that you do because you can eat a piece of cake every day if you want to you can eat a cookie every day you can have ice cream every single night and still lose weight it just depends on how much you're having and also if you're doing anything to kind of counteract that so yeah i would definitely recommend you guys to eat what you want but don't overeat okay so now my nachos are ready and i'm ready to eat them and cooper is ready to beg but yeah so these are my nachos and i put some of the salsa from trader joe's and yeah it's very good i think it's like 10 calories for like maybe i don't know i'm gonna say like what i used is 10 calories because i had like a little bit left but yeah so my camera is unfocused for some reason but i'll catch you up if i eat something later and if i don't then i'll just catch you up to end this vlog so i am finishing this vlog by saying that i'm making cookies <laughs> yeah i'm making cookies right now and i'm gonna finish this vlog off just because i want to edit it so it can be up on monday and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video i know it's been very random and very i don't think it would be that interesting but i hope you guys enjoyed and also there will be more vlogs to come just because I'm going to be vlogging more often. Cooper's trying to jump up on the bed. But um yeah, so I'm also laying on my bed because there are kids screaming outside of our apartment. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and please comment down below other topics of vlogs you want to see or just if you want to see vlogs in general. But I'll see you guys next time. I hope you guys have a great day. Bye.